Thank you for watching, liking, commenting, sharing, and subscribing right now. I'm amazed that uh, technology has advanced to the point where it is today. And yet, we still suffer from certain conditions. Uh, I have allergies, can't seem to get around the problem. Yes, I could take uh, some kind of drug, uh, a pill that would make things easier. Doesn't really solve the problem of having allergies, despite having taken, like, millions of allergy shots when I was a kid. Actually, I don't know if it was millions, probably... Okay, hundreds. Um, not a fan of needles. Uh, you know, health and technology are advancing kind of uh, in lockstep. Uh, we've been able to eliminate certain diseases, and as time goes on, uh, more diseases and afflictions will be eliminated. Whether we're able to do targeting of genes or uh, just figure out ways to combat ailments. And it sounds strange to think that, uh, you know, just a few decades ago, uh, we didn't have half of what we have today in the medical establishment. Uh, you know, I, I watched, you know, any uh, commercial that's either online, TV, radio, or whatever, and hear about a pill that seems to cure everything, except it also introduces more problems than the original problem that's trying to cure. But it's not really curing. It's just alleviating certain symptoms or potentially even elongating the process by which something may actually be destroying your body. Uh, drugs kind of scare me, to tell you the truth. I like technology. Uh, it's, it's been a friend of mine, for the most part. Uh, but there are times where we really kind of have to surrender our will to a machine. There are some of you out there uh, who have had to go uh, through an MRI before, basically uh, scanning your body, uh, taking a look deep inside. Uh, it stands for, by the way, in case you didn't know, Magnetic Resonance Imaging, MRI. Uh, they basically peer into your body and potentially could uh, pull out information that a regular old x-ray or just kind of feeling around uh, couldn't be able to do. Uh, so if you've never had a deal with an MRI, you're lucky. I happen to be one of those lucky people. Uh, we had uh, s uh, one of our contributors uh, go through uh, several uh, of these scans in time to share his experiences and ways to kind of work around uh, some of the, I guess, side effects. Uh, specifically, I guess there was a banging sound. So he was given earplugs uh, to kind of alleviate that. Uh, you can't move in, a, in an MRI when it's happening. I mean, they use it to look at your brain and spinal cord, joints, bones, heart, blood vessels, any internal organ, really. Uh, and you may not be thinking about that now because you're young or you've never had any health problems. But there's going to come a point in your life where you will need to think about it. So have you ever had to face a health decision, uh, something that was just it was terribly dramatic, where you could go one way or another? Your quality of life could be improved by using technology, or you would just continue down the path that you're continuing down now and just kind of rolling the dice. Uh, you know, you may not think of pills as a, a type of technology, but certainly it was technology that helped make those pills possible. Uh, I try to stay on a minimum amount of supplements on a regular basis. Uh, I am a big believer in letting my body kind of deal with things as it can on its own. Very rarely will you see me leaning on something else. Unfortunately, uh, my eyes are, uh, are never going to improve, at least on their own. I will always need some kind of prescription. I could go through LASIK surgery. Uh, I'd considered it, you know, in a fleeting moment. But I don't know if I, I really want to do that. Every year it seems that technology gets better and they, you know, they're they perfecting the, the system. I don't want to find out that people who had LASIK 20 years from now suddenly go blind because they, oops, they missed something. Uh, I'm going to wait. I'm going to continue to wait until I just can't wait anymore. I love technology, but there comes a point where... Even if it's there and it's available to make my quality of life better, you know, let's say, like not having to wear glasses, I'm not, I'm not ready to make that leap of faith yet. I mean, I just can't imagine 
going through life with vision worse than the way mine is now. And there are many of you who do go through life that way. More power to you. And technology could bring me to overcome that hurdle. Uh, and the shortcomings are, I guess, you know, certainly recognizable. Uh, this A problem could arise. Uh, but technology, I would say, uh, is, you know, on our side. And as far as health is concerned, I just... You know, I like upgrading the latest technology. I like having awesome technology around me here. But when it comes to my health, I, I, I'd rather deal with the technology only when I need to deal with the technology. I mean, not like I have a tinfoil hat on or anything, but uh, what about you guys? Uh, how do you feel about uh, technology and health? If you guys even think about it on a regular basis, if you have to.